We're bending on a new 5X combo die here at Rug Fabrication. We're gonna be doing quarter inch square, three eighths inch square, three eighths inch round, five sixteenths inch round, and quarter inch round all at the same time. We have five materials here. We've got our square tube, both in an O32 wall brass. We've got copper with an O40 wall. It's a 101 alloy copper. We also have 1144 stress proof steel rod, solid quarter inch, little baby one. And then 3 8 inch 6061 T6 aluminum with a O40 wall. So we're gonna bend them all at the same time. This is an interesting demonstration on ring back variety. You can see that the 1144 stress proof rod has the most spring back by far. That's this dark one in my right hand, left on your side. It sprung back a lot more than the others. So that is a very interesting piece, but that is all five of them bent all at the same time. And of course we can adjust and bend them again. You have to clamp pretty tight to get all five to bend at once since they've got different tolerances and different hardnesses, but it can be done. So we have a few different rotations set on here and we're going to make a second set of bends on these. Now, since this 1144 stress proof, the solid quarter inch bar has such a tremendous amount of spring back, I'm actually gonna use the lock pin 
Normally you use the lock pin when you're changing dies, but when there's not a lot of weight behind the machine and you take the hydraulics out to continue bending past 95 degrees, all this is gonna fall down. And that stress-proof rod, since it's a big spring, is actually gonna push it down pretty quick. So I'm going to lock the machine first. So since this 1144 stress proof rod has such a tremendous amount of spring back, it's gonna to wanna to pull the bend wheels around. So I put the lock pin in. That's gonna allow me to bring the ram back and bend further without worrying about the bend that's moving. Now we can continue bending. When we go backwards and take these materials out of the machine, you'll notice that the spring back varies quite a bit. We've got top in the two women in the second loose, grass in the third, and then in the fifth with the most spring back is the 1144 stress proof steel rod. So as you can see, we've got quite a variety in our bends here, and these were all done at the same time, although in actuality, with the different amounts of spring back, you couldn't likely make anything to any engineering or production drawings in different materials at the same time. But the similar alloys, in this case, the brass, actually did have similar spring back amounts, so you might be able to pull those two off. So this is actually the first time I've ever bent on one of our 5X combo dies, but this is a really cool way to get all five of these sizes into your shop for bending tooling that's made in the USA with a lifetime warranty affordable. These 5X combo dies are a really cool addition to our tooling lineup, and they're a great way to affordably add several sizes to your shop all at once, and they do a good job on these thin wall thicknesses like 032. This is a three and a half inch radius version. We also have the same die available in a two and a half inch CLR. And CLR is center line radius. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please subscribe and like, and we'll see you next time.